Orange Beach resident there talking about the hot topic in town, whether the city should form its own school system. Yeah, a big meeting tonight down on Pleasure Island. Fox 10 News reporter Candace Murphy joining us live outside the wharf. Candace, some pretty heated debate there tonight. There was Bob Alanis. In fact, the meeting started at 6 o'clock. It just let out a few minutes ago. A lot of people discussing children and money, two very hot topics. Now, if people vote yes for the Orange Beach to split away from the Baldwin County school system, that would mean a 5 mil ad valorem tax increase. Well, for a city where the snowbirds flock and well, it, it uh, thrives on tourism, there's really a lot to talk about. With the surf, the sun, and the sand, Orange Beach is a piece of local paradise. It thrives on tourism, and it's a city where people often retire. Live in Orange Beach, shop in Orange Beach, vacation in Orange Beach. Come next month, those who live here will be making a big money decision. Some will be voting to do something that's never been done before in Baldwin County, create an independent school system. So I believe in paying forward. I believe it's each generation's responsibility to provide for the children of that generation. A yes vote for the independent school system would increase property taxes for locals, increase lodging taxes for tourists, and increase the sales tax for everyone. I have rental property and I'm here. One thing that upsets me is I don't want my customers Customers to have to pay more money for rental tax. They already pay 11 percent. They want to take a lot of the money from what the tourists bring here and a lot of that, and that's, that's okay and that's fine. But still, a bottom line base, you know, that can go up or down with a hurricane or oil spill or whatever, and that money has to keep that school operating. Some in favor of the school split say it will create a better sense of community where the sun shines, the seagulls soar, and the waves roar. Right now, there are two options for where the new school would be built. One is near the sportsplex here. The other is near the uh, wharf. Now, there would, the school system would start with about 946 students, and that includes students who are currently homeschooled. This vote is only about four weeks away, and it's going to be on September 23rd. For now, reporting live in Orange Beach, Candace Murphy, Fox 10 News.